Yeah, that's right. Investigators say they're being fed a different stories into what led up to the shooting. Right now they're investigating this as a robbery, but say there's more than what's being told. Police who responded were not getting truthful stories from everybody at the scene. At 1 a.m. Friday morning, Oklahoma City Police responded to a call of a shooting outside a duplex near Southwest 17th and Grand. When we pulled up, the police had everything blocked off with yellow tape, um, the saying that some gunshots went off last night. When officers arrived on scene, a door swung open with a woman begging for help and a man lying inside the doorway with a gunshot to his chest. It appears that at least two people were involved in some type of a dispute. It looks like it was probably a robbery when a third person tried to intervene and help the victim. Investigators say a good Samaritan was shot trying to break up the scuffle. He was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. It appears that the robbery victim and the suspect were in some sort of fight or altercation, possibly over a gun, when the uh, good Samaritan shows up. Investigators say the shooter then hopped inside a white sedan driven by a woman. According to the police report, the robbery victim told police the gunman knocked on the door and started a fight with him, stealing over $200 worth of jewelry, before then saying the gunman jumped him after asking for a cigarette. There's a lot of information that we've been receiving from some of the people involved in this case that has turned out to be not truthful. So we're trying to weed through the stories that we're being fed. Next door neighbors say she feels uneasy knowing her kids were home. Yes, I am 100% and um, it's, it's really scary because bulls could have came through the wall or anything could have happened. Now, Oklahoma City Police say that Good Samaritan is stable. If you have any information regarding that shooting, you are asked to call Crime Stoppers.